once uh, one of our viewers, Defective Gamer, was kind enough to uh, make one of those. So let's get going here. And for some reason, I still have black bars. That is very unfortunate. That was, this was supposed to get rid of those, but it did not. And this is very loud. There we go. Uh, I hope you guys like black water, um, because this that is indeed here today. Uh, I gotta actually reposition, like make this a little bit easier to. So, that should be in a position that works. Uh, so, in this stream, it's basically going to be like you saw in the last stream. We basically uh, showed you some of the features that we had currently, and we played around in the game. This stream will be basically we'll be messing around on the game as well. Also, we'll be answering questions. So if you have any questions related to Legend of Pirates or the development or anything like that, you can post in the chat, and I will indeed answer them. And once Mike gets here, uh... oh, nice. My mic's way too soft. Great. Hold on. Let me uh, fix that. Um, hold on. Let me, let me fix. Yeah, this. Yeah, I thought so. All right. Uh, hold on. All right. So my mic volume is apparently very soft. Uh, apparently. Uh, not sure. Yeah, because my, my mic's always been kind of soft, but I had the volume maxed, so hold on, let me, uh... Might have to go... Might have to go headset mic, but hold on, let me fix that. Let me that. So, um, in this case, turn the game volume down slightly, um, which should make it easier to hear me if my mic volume's kind of low. So, hold on. And... Uh, basically, like I said, I'll be showing stuff that I, I, I showed a lot of stuff last stream. Uh, but, you know, I'll be showing more stuff and I'll answer questions as they're asked. And also be um, requests, like if you guys want to see something, I'll show it or try to show it. If it's in, can you make Legend of Pirates in 4K? The game, as far as I know, if you have a 4K mar, you can probably play, play it in 4K. Uh, keep sensing that thing. Um, the resolution settings in game though aren't even up to 1080p. I still gotta edit the resolution settings, add more modern resolutions. So, some islands 
Uh, someone in the last stream had pointed out that teleporting, that I wasn't teleporting to islands and that, you know, it's kind of tacky how it was spawning in other islands. <clears throat> the islands that you can normally get teleport access to can be teleported to, but for the other islands like SVS islands and stuff, I have to manually set my return location to, so when I log in, I go to that area. So, um, we can indeed teleport. Alright, so, uh, let me, uh, hey. let me, my volume's a little, okay, that's, I gotta, volume's on, alright, it should be good, alright, now, if I can, actually, am I, oh, I just realized I'm not logged in the switch. How much have you guys- Hey, Christopher Osho said- Oh, sorry. Huh? Sorry. Um, so- You can go. Alright, so basically, um... Um, Navi, you asked how much has been fixed since last stream. Well, last stream was only like three or four days ago, so... Um, we've been working on, um, launcher stuff instead of the game, really. So, game is more or less very similar, fixed like... Like an issue with looting and such where the looting pouch wouldn't disappear and some other small things, but otherwise it's more or less the same. Uh, I've been working on the launcher. I was working on the launcher before I started the stream, actually. Um, just so that, you know, because Alpha is in fact very close. Uh, closer than you may think. But anywho, alright, let's see. Um, what time? Okay, I'm just gonna watch you. See, Death's so I said the same exact thing I said when I <laughs> I thought the same exact thing that Death's so just said. Why not full screen? When I saw the border. Why why not full screen? Because the overlay look the overlay was something that I don't know, I kinda like I like it. So I'm going to put the overlay on here. I could do full screen, I did full screen last time, but even but if I did full screen like I did last time, there's still black borders on the top and bottom, so uh, it's not perfect, so the overlay will cover up the black that you would normally see on the top and the bottom that was on the last stream, and even though there's still bars on this on the left and right, I can't seem to get rid of those. So, in this case, um, since on the last stream we basically showed all of our current progress, and all of our current progress that was shown on the last screen basically still applies here, um, if you have any requests to see stuff that we might have implemented, then I'll show you that. And if you have any questions um, or anything like that, I'll answer those as well. So this is going to be, this won't be as long of a stream. It definitely won't be four hours. It's probably only going to be like an hour and a half long. Um, but this will actually, this full stream is being archived and will be uploaded. So um, make note of that. I'm going to go to... Hey, I'm going to add Chris to show. All right. Any fishing yet? No, unfortunately no, but uh, fishing is actually something that we, we've actually fixed one other bug on, so it might be able to be, that might be able to be worked on soon, but at the moment we're working on uh, another, another uh, feature, which you guys will maybe see in a little bit. What well, parts of the game are done? Fun feature. Uh, what well, parts of the game is 100% done? Well, we can go to all the islands, so that's one of the things that's 100% done. Uh, what else is 100% done? I really don't know what else is 100% done. I think potions is, for the most part. Potions is, except for a couple like, little bugs left few, in it. The few bugs, but otherwise that's... D oh, and also, you don't actually get the potion because that's not finished yet. Yeah, for inventory, because we don't have the inventory page set up for The it. inventory is still... Uh, it has some issues. The sea chest is one of the things in the game that are the most annoying to work with. I swear. Especially I the skill page. Yeah. The skill page where you could click to upgrade your skills. That page did not, like, that was not a very nice page to work on. Yeah. It, 
Although it's mostly still isn't. it's mostly fixed now, which is good. So on on. Oh man, when I first joined, the volume from the stream was still on and I, I got really confused for a second there. Huh. <laughs> oh, this is Christopho Show. Christopho Show, do you want to introduce yourself? Hey, I'm the guy who's been kicking you and banning you. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I don't know how to introduce myself. I guess I'm kind of always in the chat all the time. Um, <laughs> for crewing in Paco, or was that like? Yeah, that was in Paco. All right, yeah, that was. In Paco. Slash LFC. Yeah. Actually. So that's implemented. That's been in there for a little while. All right. I think I think we do have founders set up, but we don't have like the server side implementation. Yeah, I think that, like that was that yeah. didn't have any issues at all. That was just in their code. I think we don't have anything. I think that's the only thing. Yet. I think that's like the only name tag related thing left that's not implemented server side because now GM tags are. Um, so uh, I'm not looking for crew. The GM tags are beautiful, by the way. Thanks. Just, just hovering above the head, you know. <laughs> And as you guys saw when I started the stream, my GM tag was blue, even though that wasn't technically in Pirates Online. We can set the color and the text to anything oh, no, we want. No, no, oh, no, what's no, going no, on? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> That's one of the unfortunate things about when you have a live stream. Somebody can barge in. Oh, I told the people I live with before uh, this happened that they shouldn't disturb me. <laughs> Sometimes people don't listen, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. I don't know if he told anyone. Oh well. <laughs> As you can see right now, he's standing in front of a, a little house. It's beautiful. It's got wooden sides and a bush beside it. Yeah, there's um, some torches in the distance. Mm hmm. And I'm looking at an outdated screen, so when you guys look at it, the torches aren't going to be there. <laughs> so I, when I said that, he was in front of the cave. I, I kind of wonder, uh, given the, I don't know, the pirate theme, what kind of what era it's aiming for? Huh? Like, would there be electricity? at the time of this game? No, there would not be electricity at the time of this game. <laughs> uh, that's probably what the torches are for. That makes sense. It does. I don't know. It's a new new ownership. We might be able to set up some telephone poles and just say Edison came around. <laughs> <laughs> Only fire. Uh, Navi Licious asked, are caves added in position properly? Caves are added, the positioning part, no. Pirate's cave system was very, very intricate. We rewrote a little bit of it, and we kind of added our own way of calling the caves. So we have to actually go and individually add every single cave. So caves on Port Royal are pretty much done. We started adding the Pantano River, if I pronounce that right, in uh, Cuba. But uh, the exiting and things are a little messed up still.
So that's going to be a little annoying, but in time it'll be done. We don't need to actually do it on all of them because I don't think I, don't, I think we're only going to start off with uh, with, uh, what's it, Port Royal, and that's it. And then we'll add more over time. If not, it's not too hard to re to reposition it. It's just time consuming. Uh, Defective Gamer asked, is the launcher the last the last piece before closed alpha? Right now we're working on the launcher, but after the launcher there's only a couple very small things that need to be set up. Like the download server would have to kind of be finished up. Authentication server's been done for months. If anyone... Uh, if anyone knows how to write some code, our login, our login API has actually been up since the opening of the website. So if somebody would go and type in and uh, like sign in with their account, they actually could get a login cookie. It wouldn't do anything because you don't have the game to start up. But if you want to feel like you're logging in. True, but if we have a local host server attached for debugging, it would still send a cookie back. If not, it would just say the server's currently closed. No. <laughs> <laughs> People were actually able to defeat them. I think it would probably look pretty cool for us developers, maybe, to say what kind of job they have, instead of having every single one having the same thing. So devs could be like, okay, let's see who, like, what color looks best. And then the devs have first picks. Ooh, ha, ha, ha. Oh, nice, nice. My mic was off the whole time. All right. So no, it wasn't. No, well, on the stream it was, because on OBS I had to say uh, So I was talking this whole time, but my mic was disabled. All right. Uh, so basically, um, basically to recap um, what I was saying. Wait, wait, wait. Let me actually correct you one thing really quickly. All right. That's actually a good thing the mic was muted. You, you actually gave away a feature that wasn't released. I don't even know what that was. Alright, okay. Alright, so basically what I was saying when my mic was muted 
was that um, a good thing that my mic was muted because I accidentally said something that should not been said on stream, which is good. But anyways, um, not anything inappropriate, just unreleased feature. So basically, um, what I was saying in the stream basically was that, um, so um, as you can see, I have a green tag that says developer. Um, that wasn't in Paco. Obviously, Paco had the, the game masters and the host GMs, but um, the tag can actually be set to any text and any color you want. So I just set it to developer text with a green color through the database, and then I have that and everyone can see it. But on the actual server, we're probably just going to be like GM, like, pa like Paco. We're probably not going to do like any of our any custom text but we might who knows but at the moment it's kind of just like we'll probably just be game masters if we have the tag enabled i just enabled it for the stream just to give you an idea of what we can do but what we might not actually do um so then what i was also saying on stream was it was more like um so basically what i was going to say on stream is basically on my on the last stream I went to multiple different islands that couldn't be teleported to, but I still was able to go to them. We can actually go to any island, the islands, all the islands work. So if you guys want to see me go to a specific island, because I'm out of ideas right now, um, let me know and I'll explore that island. Um, I showed, I think, every island the last stream except for one, but some of you guys weren't here. So if you guys want to see a specific island, let me know. I'll go to that island. And then, yeah. Um, otherwise, I don't know. Uh, questions answered uh, ships um, when it comes to ships um, ships aren't being worked on yet it's like sailing's not being worked on yet uh, I think that was known last stream but it's not it's just something that we are not yet working on because there is more important stuff to be to be done I know you guys really want sailing but you know sailing will be probably something that you see uh, later on uh, so sailing is obviously a big feature um, what that means it might take time to implement um, Let's see is PvP implemented no PvP is not entirely implemented because well you can f you can like fight other pirates But like the PvP world or whatever Whatever it is or like some like I don't know uh, PvP is not fully working so uh, uh, let's see, uh, go to, go in the cave, let's see, uh, can you please go to, no, I can't go to Pizza Island, Pizza Island, <laughs> no Pizza Island, um, uh, I'll go to, okay. Why do I think John said that? Guys, I heard John that. did say that. <laughs> just told me on Skype, no, he really is talking. I've made a lot of progress, um, well, in turn, like, the launcher right now, uh, the GUI is not fully, um, the GUI is not fully um, set up for the launcher, so it's very ugly at the moment, which is why I don't want to show it, because it's kind of, uh, it looks bad. Um, but it's almost done. And then the back end is being worked on. So let's see, um, fishing is not implemented. That's some that'll be worked on, probably probably not that far from here, it'll probably be worked on. I went on the, let's see, can you kill potato man? <laughs> sure, totally, hold on. What is this? Uh, go to Jolly Jolly Rancher Island. <laughs> yeah. Um. Uh. Go to uh, no, later on. Interesting. What are you using the code? Can you go to the man? I see that. I don't need to do anything. I Um. What are we using to code? Uh, launcher is coded C++ with, um, yeah, it's C++, uh, which means that only, like, only, like, one person on the team knows C++, like, well, that good, so. That's a lie. I know it, too. Okay, okay, <laughs> not, not to the degree that, I, not to the degree that Nasib does. Touche. Um, so, no, it's you like can't. like baby C++, but I still know it. <laughs> urgent question is telling him I, I already answered this question but no sailing is not implemented yet and no you cannot board ships um a lot of this stuff had, like i know you guys want sailing but <laughs> sailing's just not work been we haven't worked on it yet so um yeah you'll see sailing um i'm not gonna say soon because you're probably not gonna see it soon 
that that's just the that's just the truth and fact of the matter is that sailing eventually is, yeah eventually so. and so yeah, in all honesty if i can if i could just uh, interject for a second Before. um in reality we wouldn't want sailing in the game super quickly if all the other features aren't working i mean if we look at what other pro has happened with other projects uh you see that uh, things get released, but there's still lots of other bugs going on. Yeah. And if if we release, if you guys release sailing before fixing all these other bugs, then it's just going to be more on everybody's plate. Yeah, and there's a lot of bugs, which is also why during Alpha we're releasing a feature one at a time, so people will actually test that feature and let us know the bugs we have to fix before we give them more features. Because if we give them a bunch of features, they won't test everything. So it's kind of you know just going to give them features one at a time, and so we get bugs fixed. Yeah. And that'll that'll help to make it so that the developers also don't burn out because if you're if you have like a million different bugs you gotta fix, you're not gonna really feel like doing it. But if you have one and you can just whittle down on it, then that feels a little better. Although, you know, having a lot of bugs to fix gives, keeps you busy. <laughs> yeah, it keeps us busy. Not, not in the way that we wanna be busy though. But we're still <laughs> bugs are going to be something bugs are going to be there's going to be a lot of bugs in alpha and we are prepared to fix all of them so don't worry about that bugs will get fixed we're not going to leave you guys crashing every 15 minutes on the during alpha uh even though you maybe really, every hour but even though you really don't crash that often at the moment like the biggest crash has already been fixed so at that point it would be like uh smaller bugs that are still annoying so in terms of an island to island basis, how many quests have you finished? Quests aren't implemented yet, so um, zero. <laughs> quests are another feature that aren't implemented. And quests is probably going to be a beta thing because um, you know that's that's one of the latest. questing requires almost every other feature implemented because some quests are like go get thirty gold from poker, um, and then there's like go sink thirty ships, and there's yeah, so we need go to defeat thirty skeletons. Quests will be probably the last, and then you also have to go. I imagine quests will be the last major feature implemented because you know you need sailing first, so you also need the tutorial, so you need the yeah, tutorial the stuff tutorial done. done so first, sailing so. will probably not sailing on uh, questing will probably be the last thing implemented. When do you think moving following enemies will be at? Enemies have the ability to walk, but at the moment it's disabled because there are some bugs, there are some big bugs with the movement of enemies, but that is something that's already been worked on, and probably when enemies get released, they'll probably be able to move because we'll probably finish that before we release enemies. So, um, so uh, level 18, level 16, I got my rusty cutlass. Yes, I'm probably not going to die here. Oh yeah, shout out to Jumpy, King Jumper one in the chat. Jumpy. Aw. If you guys do not know him, he's one of the most fun people you ever talk to. I would. <laughs> I would marry you. Uh, no. Alright, so I can't really level up my sword because I'm already at sword level 25. I totally did not hack that. So, yeah, so I totally leveled up. Legit. That's a little bug too, you'll notice that it's supposed to go up and be level 30, but it's not. Wait, it's we'll not, have to find where and why. It's supposed to go up to level 30. Yeah, it's supposed to go up to level 30, and when you're at level 30, it should have a little mastered tag on it. Oh, yeah. It stops at 25 for whatever reason. Which it which I think that there's one system that probably thinks 25 and another system that thinks 30. Because if both systems thought it was 25 or 30, they would work in sync and they'd have the mastered thing on it. Something and, tells me that... Because we already tested... I don't know, maybe the, AI is a, maybe the AI is out of whack. Who knows? No, that wouldn't be the AI. That'd be the client. Oh my. Okay, well, who decided to change it to 25 in the client file? <laughs> Decompilation? I don't possibly that broke the GUI, so you know, who knows what else it would break? Oh my God, GUI! Don't even go there. I'm not gonna talk about that. Uh, 
<laughs> yeah, let's... If anyone sees what the game looked like when we initially loaded it up, oh my gosh. Dude, I should... should no. Ugly. I should ruin their day and show them. <laughs> let's, for Alpha, let's revert it to that G1. <laughs> they, have to, they have to walk around with buttons all over the screen. Ew. <laughs> that would be great, wouldn't it? No, it wouldn't. You die a lot. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I die a lot. I, that's the second time I've died in the stream, and it's only been like... Hasn't been that long. Probably set on podcast. I wonder what the rest of the stream's going to be like. I'm still... I'm getting... I could actually probably log in. Is it still the old IP address? Yeah, it is. Alright, I could probably log in. I've been getting near I compiled and built, but I had if some I get, get issues. If another invalid Dude, challenge is, actually no wait, the Uber Dogs already I already hacked up the Uber Dogs, so you should like invalid challenge response thing, like because you have the deployment files on your computer still probably, so a challenge yeah. response stuff. Alright. Yeah, the way when it's set up it's kinda weird with that. Alright, so uh -huh. now I'm back on Port Royal and I don't wanna be on Port Royal, so I'm gonna go to I'm gonna go to Tormenta next. Ah, uh, Tormenta. Yeah, here we go, let's go now. Yo, could you, uh, change my UID to take me to Tormenta? Yeah, alright. Wait a second, wait a second. Oh, wait, you have to make a new account anyways, because I actually, I recloned yesterday, so DB got wiped. So I gotta wait for you to make a new account or pirate before I can do that. You wipe your, you wipe your DB every time you clone the repository? Well, I had to re-clone, so like, Ew. I had to completely re-clone, like, so, yeah. So, oh! Oh, uh, never mind. Because... I was gonna say, every time so you there's... pull, you re-clone, like, you wipe the... That'd no, be not, the no, not when I, no, not when I pull, not when I pull the changes, like, you know. There's a couple points popping around, so one of them was... What was your worst headache during development? IO errors. Yep, IO errors. Definitely. 100% IO errors. It got so bad with IO errors to the point where you would go to another grid and you would crash, or you would be fighting like a crab and you would crash right when you hit it with a sword. Like, it was, like, that was, those were the bane. That was a thing. Like, that was, the IO errors were so bad, like, you couldn't even really do anything in the game. It got, it was like, no one even wanted to play because of those IO errors. Thankfully, the leak actually has the IO errors in it, so we're kind of happy about that. Yeah, anybody who knows about <laughs> the, anybody you know who knows about that leak knows that it's got the IO errors in it. So yeah. Yeah, they actually, and the people who have it actually complain, saying this is so crashy. It's been fixed now, so. Right. You don't crash anymore, which makes it more fun to develop. So we can actually do stuff on the game. I'm trying to think of the next biggest headache. The next biggest headache Probably case. on Windows, at least for me, is those assertion fails because because of, of resources or sometimes like you go up to like you'll switch grids and then it will give you an assertion fail, but you can click ignore out of it. Thankfully. All right, so I'm gonna go to Tormenta because I have a sword stuck. I have a sword glued to my hand, anyways. So, I mean. Rip, I'm getting installed files out of date. Caves are the devil, right? No, caves aren't the... I don't think caves are the devil. Well, actually... Something else. No, those aren't... Those aren't the devil. Those aren't the devil. Caves. That's Nasib's nickname for something else. Caves aren't the devil. Yeah, that's a nickname for some. Caves are another word that we can't say on stream because it might offend some people. I'm actually looking it up to get the exact definition to see if it would be offensive. <sighs> Uh, I don't think it's actually that bad. <laughs> Alright. Uh, caves are nicknamed Lucifer, which is another name for Satan. All right. Caves are the Lucifer. Oh, that's right, I forgot about that. Alright. Uh, one to make sure. Oh, yeah. That's Caves' nickname. Yeah. Oh, there's people. We don't care if it's ugly. Eh. And then there's uh, um, the devil is is like the inventory stuff, ad locatables. Uh, something else was. Nasip also works on Toontown stuff. I think he said that 
Uh, if you go to like the places like Chippendales Acres and you go to one of those the picnic play, table uh, games. what are they called? Picnic tables. Yeah. Yeah, the picnic table games. Getting those to work. Those are nicknamed something too, because he said those yeah, are pretty he annoying. Yeah, nicknamed those the Antichrist. Ah. Uh, and then he nicknamed Garden Satan. He's he's very creative with his nicknames. Alright, so now we're on Is Tormenta. There a reason why they had it. Show us the launcher. No, Riley, you don't want to see it. It's really ugly at the moment. I wouldn't even show yeah, it. Yeah, don't show it. I wouldn't even show it to, like, my enemy. Like, it's it's very ugly at the moment. I think Mike wants to change the background, so if I showed it, it wouldn't even be the one that you're going to use, as far as I know. Because I think Mike... Yeah, I don't everyone, think like, more people... I didn't understand why, but a lot of people wanted to keep the original pirate's background, like, uh, the frame. So that's going to be in it, the original Paco frame, but we're changing up the skin on the inside. Everyone loved the Paco frame, so we have the Paco frame. I don't think Mike likes the current background, though, that Johnny put together, so... No, that's just a screenshot. It needs to be more creative. Well, then you come up with something more creative and I'll, and I'll implement it. I just sent him a PM about it. All right. What do you mean come up with some more creative? Rogue and I designed a whole entire new yeah, launch know, that I people liked, hated. I liked that one, but didn't have the frame. <laughs> I, the frame. I, 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 honestly, I don't care. Okay, Cursed Caverns, I, I can't go in here. Sorry, guys. Um, It'll work. I actually, Cursed Caverns will work. You just have to have pocket N on. Yeah. I tried doing that last stream. And I couldn't even like I went out the tunnel and then back through the tunnel, but um, yeah, I like. Gotta one, be careful when you exit. I like the one that you and Rogue came up with. Um, and I don't even really care too much for the frame, but yeah, I thought that was the one we were gonna use, but it turns out we didn't. But whatever, we'll come up with something better because it's the current one. Yeah, I don't really like it. <laughs> Rip. I don't really like because it's just like the screen. It's just like a screenshot from the screenshot contest. Like, it could be better. So I'm getting a, I'm getting a files out of date. Oh, I know why. I forgot to change. Oh Oops. yeah, you have to change. That's a it. stupid you thing. Change, you change I forgot to change version. the server version. I, yeah. That's a little skittish mistake. Oh. Oops. And also, and also, um, in my honest opinion, I think that Jolly, Ro um, Jolly Roger should be in the launcher background. Just, that could be arranged. Just my opinion, though. Because it was in the one that you made, and I really liked that one because because it was in it. So it's like there's a request for seeing female pirates. Female pirates that could be arranged as well. A request to see female pirates. Well, I'm not a female myself, as far as you guys know, but I could make a female pirate. <laughs> um, let me just let me just do that. I'm sorry, that was the worst laugh in the world. Is there currently the ability to make a super chubby pirate? Yes. Yeah, there is. That'd be really cool. But I don't, I don't, I don't, all right, so. I think you could actually change your body type through the magic word system. I don't remember the magic word though. I think there is a magic word for it though. So you can actually go through old to new, etc. I don't want to change any of that. Alrighty, I'm in. No, I will change hair. Um, anything good on here? Not really. Uh, okay, that works. Um, <laughs> whew, someone did change it for us. Tell you what, I'll make the fattest part I can to walk around with on the island. There's only one belt on here. Yes. Really? All right, guys. Fattest pirate, or fattest boy pirate, or fattest girl pirate? Let me know. I'll make the fattest one I can of each, or whatever one you take, or whatever one you choose, rather. Okay. Um. I'm gonna name it. All right. You know what? Um. I remember on the last stream, Vector made a Sarah Hardhound. Even though I'm pretty sure it didn't look anything like Sarah Hardhound. 
Um, so I'll probably do something like... Uh... Jim. Oh wow, Wonder. <laughs> of course you may make one female and you make them fat. I could do I can also make the skinniest part of each. <laughs> Name it Riley. <laughs> yeah, that's Name a great it Riley. good female. Name, Name it Riley with a question mark after it. <laughs> sure. Your can <laughs> cannot contain the character question mark. Dang it! Uh, <laughs> works for me. Until your name is approved. All right, so I had a request for boy, so I'm gonna make the oh, fattest dude, you, boy. When you make, when you make the then. female pirate, the cutscene is with the male. It is. Oh. Oh yeah. Look. I don't have to be there. Look it on the stream. It's a male. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> And this is why it's called Alpha, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh my god, that's not right at all. That is not right. <laughs> and then the game crashes. Because of... Because it of, did? Because of uh, some scratch pad. Yeah, cutscenes aren't going to be implemented in the first build, I don't think. Huh? Unless someone Michael, actually makes them Mike, perfect. Mike, you thought the scratch pad crash was because of um, the, the near eye, but it's not. It happens on dev, too. So it's it's when just that start? can't blame near eye for that near eye is perfect. It's just more work for us. I guess we're just gonna have to disable the cutscenes. Why? All right, so uh, literally that's us. Every time we find out there's a bug we need to fix, why? Mike, why don't things just work? Mike, that's just you. <laughs> No, I hear you complaining about bugs too at times. Yeah, but I don't groan like that. Well, I guess it is just me then, but everyone's still like, come on, I still why? Com I still complain, but I don't groan like that. <laughs> she way to throw me off the cliff. I didn't throw you off of any cliff. Rip. Let's no. see. Hi, what is with you and Sarah Hardhound, Maddie? You're just like, name it Sarah. Ha I named it Princess Note because there was a pirate on the last stream that Vector made named Sarah Hardhound. So I was like, eh. Riley Edda. <laughs> what the heck? I can set the name in game so I could more, I could more or less do that. Maddie was Sarah Hard. I didn't even know that, so. Okay. I could very well change the name because I think I can do set name and then I could do uh there you go. Now I'm Sarah Hardhound. It's that easy. Name LP it. Rick. Name the next I think uh it's more of a just get it done. This guy has a very fat face. Are you making like the fattest pirate you can? Yes. Oh my god. I like his clothes the way he is. I'm gonna leave all his clothes the same. I wish I could add a hat to him, that would be the seal. This guy looks like me two years ago. <laughs> Sorry, that's me. <laughs> Have you seen me what I looked like two years ago, three years ago? Oh my god, I was a balloon. A no, I decided not to creep. A, a balloon? <laughs> I will show you a picture after the stream. You will say, oh my god. Yeah, but I don't, <laughs> I typically tend, I tend to not call people <laughs> balloons. Alright, so I think that you should go as level one and try to fight really strong things. Deal. All right. Let's see. What's what's an island? John, that has, you got this. What's an island that has really strong enemies? Oh, that guy's level two. I can't really die from that. Actually, maybe I could. Who knows? Nope, I can't.
And I don't crash after it. I think that's isolated the windows. What the, the windows and possibly what the scratch pad? It's just my name gets approved. I'll restart the time. You say something about scratch pad. All right, you'll see me in a couple. Yeah, scratch pad. That's only on Windows. Okay, well that's I a didn't big, crash. Okay, well that's a big problem then. <laughs> can't have. Can't Maybe have, that's why I was like, it's not mine. Can't have issues with Windows because pretty much the majority uses Windows. So. Actually, I think the majority uses Mac. I a think, lot of people in the community use Mac. I think I think you're lying. So are you trying to? So are you telling me that if we don't release Alpha with like Mac support, then nobody's gonna play it because they all have Macs? <laughs> That's exactly what I'm telling you. But All the right. only benefit of being on a Mac is, like, with the, not the only benefit, I phrased that wrong, but um, a benefit of being on a Mac is you can be able to boot up Windows pretty quickly using Boot Camp, and you can also just get a virtual machine of it, but you can also do it Windows. But Mac comes with built-in software to do it. Chan, Ch Chan, made, Chan made the Mac runtime on a Mac virtual machine on his PC, so eat that. <laughs> I will. Why is that a I can't believe I'm playing as a female pirate. It's like playing as a female tune on Toontown when I don't do that. Uh. The female tunes on Toontown could kind of be mixed up from a distance. Well, yeah. If, they if, kind you're, of look if, the you're, if you're wearing shorts, then it's hard. If you're if you're a female tune, you're wearing shorts. It's hard to differentiate. The only thing that dev differentiates at that point is the eyelashes. But on pirates, if you were if you mistake a female pirate with a male pirate, then there is something. There might be an issue there. Because they have complete. All right, I'm running over to you wherever you are. I'm in. Where are you at? Uh, Governor's Garden. Governor's Garden. Ah, okay. I'm almost there. You'll laugh at the name I know. I want to fight these level 7s because I have a feeling that I'm going to die if I do. I think the next update should be tree physics. Tree physics. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, Mike, get to work. Gotta have those... Yeah, so Captain get those Fatso. leaves and the, and the wind. Alright, we got Captain Fatso. Seriously, Mike? Yo-ho, yo-ho, me footsteps you heard a mile away. Seriously, Mike? <laughs> Seriously. Oh, I have sword level 2, fear me. Alright, so... Uh, skills. Let's get myself sweet, why not? Got that charge up. All right, here I am in the governor's garden. And I, oh, there you are. Do you hear my footsteps coming? Actually, I don't hear anything except this sword clashing and clanging. Rip. Honestly, that's not even that fat. Okay, actually, That's yeah. That's the fattest I could make them. Okay, never mind. Yeah, that is kind of. I guess even the fattest pirates aren't that fat. They must not be American. <laughs> Ooh. Wow. Great I just a made, stereotype. I just made fun of my own country. Wow. Just wow. I met. I imagine I just offended a bunch of people, including myself. Did I just hear Christopher lead? Oh no, his mic got quiet. Yeah, I, I mute my mic when I'm clearing my throat or uh, other talking. <laughs> or typing loudly, that too. Hey, I'm the one that types loud. Are you one of those people who beat their keyboards? Oh, that's like me. Hey, I should do some typing. Uh, hey, stream, you want to no, hear me type? Don't. Don't. You were notorious yes. for beating your keyboard. Haha. <laughs> Fear my loud keyboard, because I just... <laughs> Get 
Can you hear me typing or clicking right now? Sort of, but it's like noise spam. But you've got like that MacBook. Yeah, sword level two. You've got like you've got like that MacBook Pro keyboard that feels like Jello and it's not loud at all. Yolo. Oh, you're using a laptop. Yeah, he's yes, a laptop. He has a Retina MacBook Pro. I mean. Usually, I have a MacBook Pro with Retina Display 2010. I just said that, Retina MacBook Pro. It's what's going to be building. Yeah, but I got down to the specs. <laughs> well, you got Late that, 2013. got that Intel Iris graphics, and I hate you because your water shows up good. You know, even on my PC, water shows up good. Because you probably don't have NVIDIA graphics. I don't have NVIDIA it's graphics. Like if you, if you, NVIDIA sucks. Because, I mean, Roke is on a Mac, but he has NVIDIA graphics, so his water is black. Here are my graphics. But if I went on my laptop, that's why you gotta get a desktop. And if I went on my laptop, which has Intel, then the water would be blue. And uh, because I mean, um, Brian, he has AMD graphics on Windows, and the water is blue. It's just Nvidia, because I don't know. You think that that's to do with Panda, or uh, no? It's not. No, to do I don't Panda. think it's due to Panda. I think it's because I think it's due to Nvidia. <coughs> It's because oh, of the CG deprecation of NVIDIA graphics. Yeah, oh, okay. NVIDIA yeah. kind of... They don't really acknowledge CG like anymore. Like, ditched everything. Well, even that... If it was due to CG, then the water would have been blue when you converted to GLSL. But it was still black. True. So maybe it's something with our code. I don't know if it's Panda 3D, though. With so, I, I don't see how it would be due to our code if it works on Intel and AMD, but I don't know. Who's... I don't know, maybe... Well, there's there are issues in, like, in Toontown, there are issues with different graphics cards as well, so... Yeah, but on T I mean, it could I just I, be... I remember on TTR, um, on TTR, if you had Intel graphics, then your game would look horrible, but it's, like, vice versa. If you have Intel graphics on Pirates, then it looks fine. It's kind of weird. If you had Intel graphics on Toontown, the is it only the water? Yeah, within, uh, on Nvidia, it's only the water that's broken. It's just the idea that like on Toontown, if you have Nvidia, then the game looks perfect. But if you have Intel, then like the doors and windows all flicker and stuff. Like I know people would always complain about that, but on Pirates, it's like there aren't really any issues with that. Um, it's because Pirates had stuff in their configuration file that fixed a lot of that. Water's like the only graphical bug for Nvidia. So it's kind of just something that will either get fixed eventually or we'll see. You know. Riley, Riley. All right, so now we're gonna go to Outcast Isle. Princess Nate. Um, meh. Which option of DirectX are you using? I remember launch you could choose some three options. Uh, Paco glitch. We're actually not running DirectX. We're running OpenGL. Um, if we run the game with the DirectX API, the game will actually crash before we can even load into any islands. So we're not allowing the DirectX option since it since the Legend of Pirates does not seem to like it. So you're gonna have to use OpenGL, which OpenGL is the preferred. We could probably. We, well, we could probably we could probably, we could probably like hack fix it to run road, DirectX, like but fix all the crashes. OpenGL is what if that fixes all the water issues? What DirectX? Yeah, if we use DirectX and it, it fixes all the water issues. It doesn't. I tried running DirectX nine; their water's still black. Can you hack fix everything? Yeah, and the water's still black. Um, LP. Uh, OpenGL uh, is the more preferred option, <laughs> anyways, because like that's the one that. R like RDB maintains the OpenGL and he doesn't really maintain the DirectX, so like that's why Panda 3D still doesn't have DirectX 11 support. <laughs> Let's go. Hey guys, I'm gonna kill this fly trap. Actually, that would even be a bad idea for now. How close? Oh, yep, yeah, I died. How close are you guys? Water. Having... How close are you guys having selling? We're not close at all. We haven't even started working on it. Water. You'll be waiting a while. You can convince yourself. Like very far away. You can convince yourself the water is just a really dark blue. I wish I could convince myself to that, but there's some islands where the water is kind of like really bright. Like sometimes it's even like purple. So it's kind of like yeah. it's black water. Do you have a lot of stuff on your computer? The server's a little slow. Do I have a lot of stuff. Well, I'm streaming, which might I don't know. 
that might uh true true because streaming uses a lot of bandwidth and it might not be like the, it might just be my internet like because all my bandwidth might be getting used by streaming oh man you know my internet <laughs> yeah like and i consider i have like my internet's considered like really good too so um you might do you might okay, i started attacking this undead bandit it took him like three seconds to realize i was attacking him twitch streaming time you might do combat better if you renamed your pirate to the wanderer but that would be stealing your name and that's not cool all right i'm going you guys can host it off of mine riley please no, because that would require passing around the server. Which, you know, Pearson would know all about that. Did I say that? Please. <laughs> Just staring in the background. <laughs> okay, King's Run. Well, what the heck? I don't. Okay, King's Run. I'm just like going through the tunnel. Oh, wait. No, this isn't King's Run. What the? Okay. Wait, did you say his name in the chat? Maybe. Uh. Wait, wait. Why would you say that? Who broke King's Run? I think Run's Roke was doing some repositioning. King's Run is broken now. It is? Yeah, if you go through the tunnel, you go right out the King's Run tunnel and back into Port Royal, so... Dang it, Rick. King's Run was working too, like, who messed with it? Someone must have changed that up. I think Roke was doing positioning and everything. Alright, well... Well, you gotta teleport directly there now. Can't even teleport directly there. Um, I'm receiving the objects from my clone. It's at 93%, and then I'll build you up a client and send it over to you. Chris, so you can go to connect. Um, wait, who, who I think it would be the first time you actually ever played. Oh, look at you right here. Hi. I just left here coming to find you. <laughs> so, yeah, I, should, I shouldn't have made that piercing comment. That, that, uh, I'll probably edit that out. Don't talk about it, man. Well, the Don't stream. Don't talk about it, then. When I, I'm gonna edit. I'm gonna edit the stream anyways. So. Don't give yourself more work to edit. Come on, okay. uh, yeah. Do you have to reposition? In all reality, we play. reposition it through. Uh, Navi, we don't have a map editor, so we have to reposition it all manually. Fun stuff. There is a thing called the level editor, which helps which uh, allows you to edit your uh, what's it called your islands but we don't have it. Disney had that. Yeah, um, there's a level editor folder which would have had the level editor but Disney did not include it so we don't have their level editor so we have to reposition everything manually so unless we rewrite unless, unless we, we rewrite, rewrite their level somehow letter, get that level a lot editor. Of time to we can either somehow get that level editor or we could make our own eventually who knows but uh, otherwise, I think it is public somewhere. Probably, but it didn't work because like, yeah. it was outdated. Yeah, I don't think it worked exactly. Um, Would it be the same as the Toontown one, or is it? Are they different? No, it's different. Uh, Pirates doesn't use DNA. Pirates uses world data, so Toontowns wouldn't work. Right. All right. All right. All right. Um, what was, I forgot what I was gonna say now, but basically. We're trying to we're trying to reposition this all so it looks exactly like Paco, and for the most part, it does. Um, you know, it's kind of off. Like as you saw, King's Run, the tunnels like flipped, so messed up. But I'll fix that. Um, Sleeky clean. That's a good name. No, really, that's actually pretty. I don't know what sleeky means, but. He's a uh, sleek now. Is there a... Oh, sleek now. Okay, I didn't. I didn't yeah. know that. It's like squeaky clean, sleeky clean. Yeah, I get. I know sleek now. No, okay, so. All right. I don't want. Grog. He's sleek now. R M Grog. All right, bye Grog. So here's here's one from a question from me. Was there ever any thought to reputation 
per island, so maybe like uh, you gain reputation for like a faction or something on an island. Like Tortuga has a random reputation associated with it. No. There was never any isolated reputation rewards. Everything was pretty much global. There's a file called Avatar Types, which defines a lot of that stuff, I think. There is such a thing oh. as specific loot. Like, you could define that this thing will only drop this, but that's about anything that's specific. Let's see, where should I go? Um, what about, like, ach achievements? Like, even with your actual islands, like, if, if back in the original Pirates, um, if you were already past the Raven's Cove quest, you could get a cursed weapon on, I think it was Tormenta in Raven's Cove, it wasn't actually the island itself that dictated that. It was the enemies that were on it. So, have you ever seen, like, a, a sand crab or some kind of crab on yep. Tormenta drop a cursed weapon? Probably not, because those I, those uh, avatar IDs aren't actually designed to drop that kind of weapon. But if you go after maybe some of the water ghosts, those can. So, one, one area we didn't show on last stream was Pantano River because uh, the connector tunnel wasn't there, but it now is. It's still a little messed up though, so when you go in and go out, it's a little messed up the positionings. Yeah. So be ready to use Rocket Man in it. Yeah. But Tiodalma's there. Yeah, Petner, Tia, Alligator. Tiodalma's there. Uh, let's see. I thought about adding an idle animation to it. And this fly trap. <laughs> the wonder well that would have been good to know so you're i'm thinking you're one of those people who were attacking crabs on tormenta and we're like i'm not getting any cursed weapons <laughs> yeah so if you want to get a cursed weapon go inside uh the cursed caverns maybe go to the thrall room or something you'll probably have better luck there do you think that's um do you think you'll be able to make uh drop table spots public like no Probably not, because then it would defeat the purpose to go and attack Then there's no attack then people would then people would know where to loot. You don't want them to know every you don't want them to know exactly where to go for looting. I don't even really want to know all of it because then I want to be able to go and attack maybe Darkheart and not think, oh, maybe I won't get this. All right, kill. Is it but I'm pretty sure you've also never seen a level 1 drop a legendary sword because that's also impossible. Just saying. That's one that everyone's probably already been able to assume. What about um, for the API? Do you think you'll be extending that past just login? Maybe. I always thought it'd be neat to maybe be able to report that there's a Queen's and Revenge going by or maybe there's an invasion going on so if you're on the launch you can be able to see before you go in hey there's an invasion going on and maybe even an extension to that could be something like character pages on the website or something but obviously that's far down the road that would be a yes those are leaderboards and there's also a player directory player directory would be able to actually parse the whole entire System and okay, be able to have so all the profiles. It spawns you in. That. Whoa, it spawns you in Glitch World. Yeah, you gotta fly over. Pull up the map, you'll be able to see where we go. You don't gotta fly over, you gotta swim over. Oh, you landed in the water? Yeah, and I gotta swim over. Alright. You won't be able to swim over. Yeah, I did. Now I'm back here where the. I'm back over here. <gasps> oh, you're on Cuba. I thought you meant you went into Pantano River. Which is in Let's Cuba. Just say, if you were. I thought if you were actually in the oh no, I was in, exiting in the cave area. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say if you were in the cave area and you hit water, you might want to restart your client or go back to Cuba because you won't be able to go there. If you hit that glitch and you try to go to any other island, your game will be glitched till you restart. So it's kind of. Um, I didn't know that. It's kind of annoying when that happens, but that's what happens when you try to go in caves that are broken. Um, all right, so what other? Let's see. I'm gonna go to Perdita. I forgot to add you as a friend. Uh, what island do you go into? Perdita. Could you send me there too? Yeah, alright. Let's see, where's the database? Dang it. Perdita. Yay! The repository finished loading! Okay, so now I can finally build Mira and I can, sit, I can ship over a 
EXE to Christopher Osho. Uh, that was sending nice, Captain quick fill. Fatso. I'm sending Fatso over here to Perdido. So. Alright, so a really long time. Perdido. Bless you. Thank you. Alright, 40%. Just load already. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, there we go. And of course, insertion pin. <laughs> Is there a streaming service that doesn't um, delay it, or are they pretty much all delayed? Uh, well, Twitch has an option where um, Twitch actually has like this new option. Apparently, it's in beta where you can reduce the stream delay, but for people with slower internet, it will cause their player to, to constantly buffer, so I didn't enable it. Good point. Her data doesn't lag at all, like 60 frames. This is so nice. All right, cool. Ooh, this is weird. All right, Terror Wasp. I really want to battle this guy. Actually, yeah, I do, because it's a... Who, do, who doesn't want to fight a giant wasp? Actually, many people don't even want to fight a small wasp, so... <laughs> uh, oops, I know, uh... All right, just give myself HP back. Alright, so I'm not getting any loot. I haven't gotten a single I haven't gotten any loot in this entire stream. It's like the I guess I haven't been level 19. No way. And I'm having issues building the gear I this is why I don't like updating things. Is this like the one time you're having issues? Yeah. Is it because of the update? Yeah. Huh. I can't find the, uh it said compiling CXX codes and then it crashed, saying Windows error, the system could Oh I think I know why. I'm running not in the Visual Studio 2010 command prompt, I'm running in the regular one. Huh. Derp. Got my rusty cutlass here. My last stream, I actually had a broadsword, but database got reset, so I'm here with a rusty cutlass, which is why I was trying to get loot to get a broadsword again. Um, instead of mainly having to give it to myself in the database, but I'm not getting any loot today. Here we go. Okay. So it wasn't due to the update, it was due to a user error. Riley, use a blowtorch to kill bugs. That seems very over. That seems very excessive and also a waste of fuel. But, <laughs> but you know. How does that work out for you? Is this island just composed of wasps? Like. Literally, it seems there's only wasps. And. Ooh, there's a linker error. And caves with no tunnels. Resolved external symbol. Is there a command to set the time to date? Uh, no, actually, I don't think so. Or is it just is it on a per island basis or something? No, the time of day of the time of day applies for all islands. As far as I know, I'm pretty sure the time of day manager applies to all the islands, so it's like pretty sure. I don't know. And then time of day should also be server side, I think, so it should be the same time for everybody. Correct. And when you when the think uh, when the game thinks it's out of date, it will actually resync with the server. Um, I 
anyone remember that bug where the caves would disappear so you can't enter the dives and know if the, the cave's disappearing? Hmm. I don't know if that bug hasn't occurred yet. You know, if the, if the chances are if the tunnel's not there, it's because it's not positioned correctly. So in this case, there's no tunnel there, so I could just go and glitch and go into the glitch world. Okay, this is really weird. Getting unresolved external symbols. <coughs> Potions are pretty good. Let's see. Unresolved external symbol. You'd think that it would not... Oh, you think that it would not compile if it didn't have that. How about chat, John? What? How well how well is chat working? Uh chat's working pretty good. Was that a question in there or was that one of yours? That's just one of mine. I'm just filling in. Everybody else is just staring at the wonder wonderful stream, so as far as I can I understand why there's not as many questions. As far as I know, chat doesn't have any major issues with it. Except, uh, no, actually, I don't know really that many issues with chat. Um, except for, like, no true friends, but that's about it. I guess I should eventually send you that blacklist. <laughs> yeah, our blacklist, uh, the one on the game is still the original blacklist. Like, the the one that um, was originally given to me. Yeah, that's the one that's still in the game because oh. we put both of them. We put the blacklist in the game and then sent you the one that was on the game and we never updated it. Oh man. We only updated the whitelist. <laughs> so yeah, the yeah, whitelist is one, still really old. We we I think I will whittled off about seven hundred words or more. Yeah, some of the so. words in the blacklist were just completely unnecessary. <laughs> uh, let's go to PR and play a game of potions and hopefully not crash. Potions still has a ton of crashes, but beyond that, like the AI and everything sound. Recipe done 41. I love how it just prints like the the idea of like you're supposed to know the idea of the potion like 41. I don't know that what that is. And I'm on his lip or did a. Well, I'm going back to Port Royal so I can get some potions. <laughs> did you already leave? Yeah. Rip. You can just teleport to PR. It doesn't really matter. Oh my gosh, there's a huge wasp here. Oh, nice assertion fail. Nice. That's a great assertion fail. Whoa, that thing kills really easily. Do you want that list comma delimited? Wait, what? Do you want uh, do you want it to be comma delimited or just a word on every line? On um, the game, it's divide. Uh, the game blacklist is basically like it's in the source so it uses Python syntax where it's in quotes and then it's um and then it has commas 
So oh. uh, you can just send it anyway, and then we'll and then we'll send, and then we'll lay it out for the blacklist. I just have it uh, word per line. That's fine. Ready. So typically, when I pay spin things like this, they get taken down very quickly. What? <laughs> Why do they get taken down? I think because because there's so many bad words in this that are absolutely ridiculously bad <laughs> that it just kind of oh pastebin will take it offline. Yeah, dude. Uh, so pastebin <laughs> doesn't want. The, wow, I've never heard a pastebin actually take down stuff for having too many inappropriate words. I guess I they set, do. Either way, I set the time out for ten minutes just to. Um, so yeah, just copy paste it. Uh, I'll. I'll paste it to you somewhere special. Hopefully not Twitch chat. Yeah, put in Twitch <laughs> chat. <laughs> that would be... I'd ban myself if I, if I did that. <laughs> I've banned myself before, so... You banned yep, yourself? Yep, our service done that to you. Oh, our... Yeah, right, yeah, that's... He's got, he's got some interesting personality, he does. I was trying to come up with a name. A really radical something service. <laughs> Potions are so broken. Like, oh my god. It's only one file that's causing the it's, issue. And I think we it's go actually to two. verify it, and there's like so yeah, many just issues. Cr just it? crashed right there. I think there's actually two issues with it. I think that it's Potion Game Board and Potion Game FSM. Um, Once those are fixed, it'll be fluent. It'll have no issues whatsoever. <laughs> Well, looks like it's like a simlink problem, but I don't. <laughs> Potions actually is pretty interesting how it works. It looks at what textures are there, and it will, like, it will identify what potion is there by its texture. So if you have two things of the same texture, it'll know they're the same thing, and it'll make the next thing in the line, which is kind of neat. Not how I thought it would be working. It doesn't even make sense how it's like the most broken thing in the game, though. Like, you wouldn't expect potions to be the thing that has the most issues with it, but it does. Oh, right. I just love this black water. So, is it CTO Mural? I, I don't, don't know how to pronounce it. I'm gonna I copy. Was... I'm gonna copy all this to a uh, to a paste bin. No, not a paste bin. To a notepad document, and then I'll put it in the game. Uh, all right, there we go. Just make sure it's not shown on the stream. It's not. You no, know, my web browser is <laughs> open on my set on my other monitor. Good. I. This is why I have dual. <laughs> There's. That's why I got dual monitors up in this. Uh, I, it's all alphabetical now, which is beautiful. You actually. I think I added something to it. You ours. actually sorted it alphabetically. Wait. I used. I used the. I used the program. It's okay. All right. We're just gonna say. You did it's that. easier to add and take away words. Uh, we uh, then when we used to when the whitelist used to be in the resources we put in the source code now some um, just for better security when it used to be. In the resources, we had a whitelist formatting tool that would alphabetically like sort. I actually still use that. Does it still? I. Uh, <laughs> it'll still work. Oh, all right. You just have to throw it the Python document when you're done. Yeah. I should show you what I. I basically put it all into a gigantic regex. It's disgusting. <laughs> it works. Disgusting. Oh, it's very very fast. <laughs> Let me uh, open gross. my GitHub. Yeah. I'm actually gonna upload that and show it to you because it's hilarious. Things that the users should never, ever, ever see. <laughs> yeah. There, I pasted it. <laughs> uh, where did you paste it to? In the staff chat. Uh. Oh, there it is. Oh, I see. Oh, all right. Okay. 
Ew. It's, it's pretty bad. Look at all those more. <laughs> it's. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> I have so many unread. That's our serve code. Isn't our serve code? It is. Yeah, that's Pearl. Well, our serve does a pearly white job. Da -da. Uh. <laughs> that was a bad pun. Didn't even make sense. Just a wee bit. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, where are you at in Port Royal? Uh, I'm near the jail. Near the jail? Okay. Coming to you. I'm actually, I'm surprised that the, quote, fat, end quote, pirates are just like, just have a little belly, and that's it. <laughs> yeah, they're not exactly- called a beer gut. They're not exactly the fattest people around. Uh huh. Oh, I'm pretty sure we could be able to arrange otherwise. No, Mike. <laughs> I think that'd be amazing. No, Mike. We don't need fatter pirates. Oh. I crashed. <laughs> if you look at pirates, like the actual movies, there are some pretty big guys. You, you like the one in the third movie. You crashed. Ru mu bleh, you crashed. Mike. Throw back to Singapore. Mike, what'd you crash for this time? I walked across the grid. Rip. Segmentation fault. Aw. Uh, it's the thing you'd get when you enter this graveyard, the assertion error. Oh yeah, the assertion fail, yeah. The only difference is on Mac, you can't just click the ignore button. Rip. I doubted some sort of debugger, I'm sure I could get it to do it, but oh well. I like the midget guy. <laughs> The old, uh, old bodies, there was one that you could make that was pretty big. Well, we're putting in the old body types, The one with so. the parrot? Well, we're putting in the old body types, so that'll be real to have that. Yeah. Um, All right, dude, I'm the game was shut down. This is a remake known as Legend of Pirates Online, which is still in development. Um, this is not Pirates Online. Pirates Online was shut down, like, two years ago. Uh, what? Rip. What was that? <laughs> Look on the, the stream. Look error. on the stream. Look on the stream. You'll see it in a second. Oh, I saw an assertion error the second he says that. I always forget that there's lag. Oh, there's a cave there. Uh, it goes to Governor's Garden and then watch what happens when it loads. You go through and then back out. <laughs> it's a teleportation portal. Yeah. <laughs> Get it right, a teleportation portal. I don't want, that is weird. Rosetta Zim. That's awesome. <laughs> Rosetta Zim. Some of these pirates are like tiny. They're short, like really short. Or I don't know, maybe I'm just tall, I have no idea. Or more specifically, piratesonline.co. I'm going to uh, Pirates of the Caribbean, the IMDB, and I'm going to look up pictures of the characters. I want to see Pirates of the Caribbean. The semblance, how close they are. Dingy, dingy, dingy. Oh no, the seas are closed. How do you close the seas? Like, like I don't get. Like, would you just put like a big closed <laughs> sign like on a boat in the middle of the in the sea? Just like you can't go in here. Like, how does that work? Yep. Pretty much. Oh, 
Oh, loot! Loot! What I- Oh, I'm- Monkey blunderbuss. Ooh. <laughs> Not probably what you were looking for, but- Not what I was looking for, but better than the pistol. Nice. Good call, Mike. Huh? The topic. Uh, Death Slice recommended it in PM. Ooh, this blunderbuss <clears throat> is nice. That does some pretty good damage. I like it. I'd say that was a good loot. A good old loot. I got Miracle Wire that I can't use. Uh, <laughs> who do you think would win a PvP John Alfire or MF Wasp? Uh, MF Wasp would win because he's actually played this game and I haven't, so... Um, uh -huh. I actually played Paco and I didn't, so yeah, I'm just not really good at this game. Uh, so. Is there really an argument in the chat right now about who, yeah, who there, I love? Yeah, there's an Well, it's, not, it's a discussion on who would win in a PvP fight. Mike loves me so more. I love Mike more. No, I like Bob more. What? I guess there's a discussion. I guess the discussion has changed a bit. Feel the love. Uh, where are you at now? I'm fighting crabs with my blunderbuss. Okay. Have you ever ever played it? Have you ever played a game other than Pirates Online where you can shoot crabs with a blunderbuss? I don't think I have. It's <laughs> very original. Oh, dude, a loot chest! I got a loot chest from killing a crab. What's in it? Wooden charm, Thanksgiving shirt. Why is it a female shirt? And Miracle, <laughs> and Miracle Water, I'll take that. <laughs> I've never gotten a loot chest before. And how the heck do you get a loot chest from a level 2 sand crab? But Beats not, me, but you got it. That's the first loot chest I ever got. Is that a Thanksgiving shirt? Yeah, I got a Thanksgiving shirt. It's a female shirt, but I got it for a, on a male pirate. <laughs> that's awesome. It's actually pretty common. Yeah, that's not too hard to XP. It's, a, it's actually Oops. pretty common. It's been common to get female clothes through looting. Rope got a bunch of female clothes through looting. Can you wear them, or is this just for I, fun? I don't know. I'm not going to try. I'm not really a cross-dresser. <laughs> you should try. I want to see if it breaks the game. It's more exciting. It would, if it, I don't know. It would probably break my pirate, then I'll lose my blunderbuss. You could tweak it in the database. <laughs> yeah, but I do, I do not like editing the inventory database. I do not like editing the That database. is very picky, the inventory database. Yeah, if you mess up, like, if you even make, like, a slight typo, you'll break the inventory database. I don't like Totally not cheating with my level. No death spice, there is no digging. Uh, it, it just rejects it, so it'll just say there's nothing interesting every time. I think we should make a we should make a poll and then if people vote that you try on the shirt, then you have to try on the shirt. <laughs> oh, so make a GoFundMe or something. Make JWHNL5 put on the female shirt. Yeah. Where's the clothes now, even? Now knowing where this, the it'll probably happen. Where are the clothes even? Oh, but I can't wait. You can't access the clothes panel yeah, yet. Yeah, so I can't change clothes. Ha! Oh, okay. Uh, you win. It's broken. All right, let's see the loot we get from this giant crab. Didn't drop any. Rip. Oh yeah, look at the chat's going crazy. I know we're, but they're hearing us behind what we're saying, so. Once they hear that I can't try the shirt. Once they hear try that I can't even try the it on, then they're gonna be like, Bleh. they're probably gonna report me to Twitch. <laughs> it's gonna come back to you. It's gonna later on when you can try on shirts. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. I'm gonna have to try it on. <laughs> and when we can't, yeah, when we can't yeah. change our clothes. I will personally, I'll personally record trying it on and send the video. I'll post in the IRC or something. Oh. Yes. Did Riley? Riley actually made a poll even though I can't wear it. What the heck? 
Sorry, a really loud car just drove by. I guess Paco has cars now. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I muted my mic, it probably cut off. But I didn't mute it fast enough. That's guys, people up here, they like guys, to cut off with guys, their cars. Guys, Mike's working on cars. <laughs> for Paco. Oh, Riley just posted the Zoom. <laughs> This isn't the world of cars online. This is Pirates of the Caribbean yeah, this online. Is not, this isn't World of Cars online. This is Legend, <laughs> this is Legend of Pirates online. I mean, oh, and if you also want to know, Pirates confirmed. <laughs> they're also working on um, Pet Rocks. It's gonna be great. We're gonna I mean, get to talk to it. And who are you, it. Patrick Star? No car, <laughs> no cars in this game. If you got. No, no, no Grand Theft Pirates. And Grand Theft Pirates wouldn't be wouldn't be stealing cars. They'd be stealing each other's ships. Like no, just, we'd be stealing gold from each other. You'd just be like, get out of that war galley, and I want to... you just, like, force, <laughs> some, force someone out of a war galley. And... Get out of that war galley, and then you could probably... Well, I'm pretty sure somebody you can make a video of that. You try to force someone out of a war galley, and then get... If you aren't the owner of the ship, you could take control over it. Get, you try you to, could like, also boot people off ships and stuff. Try to take over someone's war galley, and then get shot with a cannon, like, you know... This is blunderbuss. I'm like taking forever to kill this thing. Don't shoot him with the blunderbuss. Wow. I want to see how much rep I get. You're not gonna get any rep. Of course I will. I might level up to be a level three in my oh. in my shooting. Whoa, dude! It's a stake <clears throat> forever. 8.32. I, I was to... 8.32. I was Finally. actually... Finally. I was actually going to end this at 8.32, but I'll keep going until probably like 9. I don't know. We'll see. Hey, did you level up? Oh, Dude, yeah. I got, like 100, I got like 100 rep from it. And no loot. You totally, you should totally add uh, an underwater level. An, under, <laughs> an underwater level. It'll be the hardest level in the game. You know. Just Ooh, to, uh, I actually could disable collisions the and go underwater. Here, take a look. I'm going to disable collisions on my client and go underwater. Do it. Ready? That means okay. that you both have to. I'll take this dagger. Um, Alright, so now I have a new dagger, too. Oh! Oh, it has knife throw. And... Yes, King Jumper. Bruh. Yes, King Jumper. Disney. Wait, are you? Yes, Disney broke Paco to pretend that they're remaking the game. We secret. We secretly work for. We secretly work for Disney Interactive. We are secretly Imagineers. What a title. Oh, a loot pouch. What am I gonna do with a layered skirt? Take it anyway. Wear it. I can't change it. Put it all my... on. <laughs> I'm not gonna wear no skirts. <laughs> it's a kilt. Come on. A kilt. It's a trap. <laughs> it's a kilt. <laughs> Here, let's attack this together. <laughs> Jumper. He just my, called it. My Mikey works for Disney now, Heart Face. Oh my god. <laughs> um, why did I say face? Heart. Heart Face. I'm tired. I'm tired. Stop. <laughs> Mike, it's 8 30, please. Yeah, but I'm still tired. Oh, loot pouch. What's in this? Oh, I. Jungle throwing knives. Nice. You're not jumping enough, by the way, John. You gotta jump more. I'm not jumper. <laughs> okay, I'll be a jumper. I'm gonna jump this crab here. I'm actually dying faster while jumping the crab. <laughs> hey, Riley, watch me no scope this sand crab. Ooh, wrecked. My god, don't even go there. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm getting no loot Did you figure out that? Maybe I should swap a shard. 
kind of just all external symbol, man. I don't know. Hey, I was about to quick start ha. that. Oh, I just missed. <laughs> oh. Riley, I actually don't even play Call of Duty. So. Ooh. Why oh can't you? Hey, stop hitting me. Why don't you attack this giant crab? Like, you're avoiding it. Call a pirate ship warfare 3. <laughs> ship warfare 3. Oh. Uh, that's gonna be the new DLC for Legend of Pirates. He's lying. And no, disclaimer, there's not actually going to be de downloadable content for Legend of Pirates ever. Everything I say is a lot. Dude, I'm getting a lot. Ooh, a Venom Cutlass. Oh, you got that from the loot pouch? Come on. Nice. No, there will never be we, no microtransactions. We won't, we won't even take donations, man. We're not gonna no microtransactions. I wonder if the streams uh if the streams chat is archived. So when it when you play back and you hear the people talking. You'll have a chat to go with it. No, it's not. And see, it's here us talking, like, literally randomly. And no, Riley, I'm not insulting Call of Duty, I just don't play it. Like, I don't really... I haven't played Call of Duty in years. Like, two or three years. No. Oh, did I just hit you? Uh, I think I hit you. I don't know. Huh? I don't even know anymore. New texture pack, 10.99. Oh, by the way, um... I don't think, uh... I don't think um, you guys are aware of this, but there actually will be the ability in the Legend of Pirates to make texture packs where allowing content pack support natively, so it's not like, you know, you'll be able to make, if you want to make texture packs, you can, uh, you know. Yeah, you want to shoot this big crab with your blunderbuss? Sure, I'll shoot this big crab with my blunderbuss. Whoa, did it miss, or did it not do much damage? Uh, it missed. Oh, let me actually, I think I might be able to upgrade. Uh, uh, yeah, I can... Did you guys visit the island you didn't last time? What? Uh, we visited a few islands that we have at the last time. Cool. Alright, we gotta get people given some suggestions on what they want to see. I'm sure Weapon people enhancements. Know. Dude, my blunderbuss is missing quite a bit. Oh. Yeah, this is kind of like enchanting in a way. But when it doesn't miss, it does quite a bit of damage. Oh, it missed again. Rip. It takes a little, it takes a little bit to reload too. Did it? It missed again. Oh, I give up. You know, what? I'm not, I'm not fighting you with this anymore. Really, Ryan? John is bad at shooting. Hey! That's a pretty good bait. Oh, there was no loot. Come on. Bro, give me some time to hit this thing. <laughs> These are my crabs. That's great. <laughs> That's, you know, very aggressive of you. I, I pasted you something, Mike. I don't know if that'll help. But. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Let me check that out in a second. 
It's not very descriptive, so. Okay. Tired of battling crabs. Crabs. <laughs> so many crabs. I'm gonna go to wherever this goes. I don't even know anymore. Wait, that no, goes basically, to which, okay. you've given the entire loot table away for crabs now. Ooh, level <laughs> three shooting. Wicked thicket. All right, kill some squirrels. And it's not as laggy here either. So. Right. so I'll go inside. We can pick it also. This cave exterior should be a jungle one. Interesting question from Sleeky. What was the question Sleek had? Do you guys uh, get rid of the floating Jolly Roger soul when you defeat the enemy? Uh, there. See it floating. No, that's still there. As you can see when I'm killing enemies, there's a floating Jolly Roger head. Well, I did it. Good. I couldn't see it behind the pirate head. You mean Jolly Roger? A lovely border. Yeah. It gets blocked by Jolly Roger, so nobody can actually see what I'm invoking. He's pretty jolly, isn't he? I don't know. Yeah. Waiting for that leaderboard page to one day, one day. Jolly Rancher, no jumper, no no Jolly Ranchers. Now I want a Jolly Rancher. You guys, I thought you did get rid of. Oh no, we didn't get rid of it. Crash. We didn't get rid of it. it. Just wasn't like we had to add it back because it was missing. But it's in the game now. No, we never got rid of it. It wasn't in the Sleep. game. We never got rid of it. It was it was broken at first. Remember, first implemented enemies and it was missing. So then it got added. It back. was added back afterwards. Yeah. That was an issue with something else. You want to see sailing? Well, I guess I can't can't show you something that doesn't yet exist, really. And I so I can show you an assertion failed though, right there. Apparently. Can you dig? Well, there's another assertion failed. Charles, are you planning on playing? Apparently, a uh, apparently the rowdy rooster will print out your hard drive's contents if you go into it. So. Wait, I want to see my oh. hard drive's contents printed out. Okay, load it for me. <laughs> see, these streams are fun. This is why they last so long. Will that error happen on Alpha, John? Hopefully not. We can ask William Turk over here. He might be able to answer. Oh, uh, you went inside the bar? Yeah. Oh. Why is it EITC guy? Wait, what? Oh, this. What guy. bar are you in, Rowdy Rooster? Yeah. I don't know. I'm gonna pop a quick message in. Aaron uh, Amoris, I don't know who that is. For so. a second.
black, black Mac, yellow Dan. <laughs> Just saw the wave. Flipping a coin. A little coin flip. Wonderful thing. Alright. There's like, um... There's, uh, uh... Let's see, what else do we have here? Celebrate. The sleep, the sleep one does nothing. There's slash like a message in staff chat. Did you guys just handshake each other or get some more? Huh? I think you guys were having a thumb war. Uh, I didn't hear what you said, sorry. <laughs> it's not a thumb war. It looks like... It's My headphones are bad. My headphones are bad, I'm sorry. They say that the coin flip is back. Was it removed in Pirates Online or something? Yeah, we're adding it back though. Well, I can tell you it's already been added back, but yeah, I didn't know that was removed. Dancing a jig looks weird. Dun, 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 dun. There's like, there's like someone where you can, uh, I forget what it is. It's like, well, there's angry, which is like. Yeah, there is an angry. So, I know that the Toontown games had to remove the Disney characters from them. Uh, it's they, kind of hard to be able to do that in Pirates. Because the Pirates, Disney's characters, uh, like Captain Jack Sparrow, are uh, conveniently honestly, standing in the bar with, here. Like, with Toontown, they... On Toontown, they... They say that they had to remove all the Disney characters, but if they had to remove the Disney characters, then they would have also had to change the names of the playgrounds because it's still like Chip and Dale's, Acorn Acres, Goofy Speedway, There's Donald's Dock. Minnie's Melody Land. Like, they didn't change the name. And also, on the tunnels, the character icons are still there. The only thing they changed, the only thing they removed was like the characters actually walking around. So it's like, I don't think they were required to. They just didn't want to put them in, which is fine. They don't have to do that. But. I don't think it was really a requirement because if it was a requirement then they would have to change the playground names from Donald's Dreamland to like just Dreamland or something. Maybe Davy's Dreamland or something similar like that. Davy's Dreamland? Well, I don't I don't think the name itself it was was copyright, just the image. No, but you can still see Disney characters in game like play, like Match Mini. You know. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah, they're still they're still floating around in there. It'd be kind of hard. I think to, it would be interesting to. It'd be kind of hard to remove Jack Sparrow from a game where he's so relevant. Yeah, like yeah, the game, like the entire premise of it is based on the Black Pearl and Jack Sparrow to the yeah. point where it'd be almost unfeasible to think of the game without him. Yeah, that makes sense. Or you just do a find and replace on his name with like Captain Jumpers Jack. Dr Jumpers um, Dreamland. <laughs> Jumpers, Jumpers Dream. Captain Jack Jumper. Yeah. Then you Jumpers, have Double J, so Captain, it's JJ. Captain Jack Jumper. We <laughs> need to have a praise the sun emotion. I don't know. I don't know, Wander. You should I actually. Huh? I don't I think, think there's no curious the about. If if you end end up replacing all of the textures, replacing uh, most of the code. And also, you know, names and stuff within the game. Do you think that it would no longer be under copyright by uh, Disney? It would no longer be under copyright. Yes. It, it would no longer be under I copyright. I think so. At that point, it would. At that point, it wouldn't really be a revival of the game. It'd be a whole new game. It wouldn't be intellectual property. It would be the image because it's the same game areas and there's also the same models. Unless we remodel everything in the game. And at, which at that point, if we remodeled it, changed the code, it'd be a whole new game and not a revival of a game. So it'd be, you know, of course. I don't think any, I don't think we'd ever do that. But 
<clears throat> all we have to do is really just follow like standard copyright laws where you can't make money off of it and stuff like that and, you know follow stuff technically like this is educational yeah. but not that kind <laughs> of educational yeah <laughs> thanks for muting me sad f <laughs> Riley Riley don't be like me don't don't be like me I already get into enough trouble as it is don't be like me. Uh -huh. And you're probably going to get yelled at it after the stream, too. Yeah. Um, um, Riley, please. save yourself. <laughs> Surprised I didn't get a Skype message from Riley like, You really banned me for 10 minutes? Why are you still looking for a crew? So, uh, that's it. That's probably it for this stream, guys. I'm going to head out. I'm going to probably work on the launcher. Um, you know. I got stuff to do right now, and Mr. Potato Chip saying I broke a rule or something. Uh, so, yeah. All right. So, see you guys next stream. This stream will, is will be recorded, so you can watch on YouTube. I'm not sure when the next stream will be. Um, maybe soon. Maybe whenever we get a new feature up. Uh, thank you for watching, and have a good one. I'm just going to give a shout out to a couple people on the stream here who are I'm just going to give a shout out to a couple people on the stream here who are in fact um let's see who who can I give a shout out to? I'll give a shout out to the following people: Death Spice, King Jumper 1, The Wanderer, Ryan's Ryan's Gate, uh Sleeky Clean, uh Navilicious. Uh, I'll give a I'll even give a shout out to to Mr. Potato Chip. I'll give a shout out to Riley Peacekeeper's GM. Uh to Telepo Hippie. I'll give a shout out to um, Christopher Show. I'll give a shout out to MF Wass. I'll give a shout out to Johnny the Pirate. I'll give a shout out. You all, you all get a shout out, except for people who did not enjoy this stream, in which case. Um, uh, but everyone here, you all get shout outs, and I hope to see you all later on uh, in the next stream, uh, whenever that is. So thank you all for tuning into this stream, and have a good one.